Hello Bear Cubs, it's Mrs. Sure. I'm so excited to be able to do some songs with you right now. We've been, um, I gave you guys some activities at home to work on with your moms and dads, some elephants. Well, actually it wasn't an elephant, it was a zebra and a giraffe. And there's also a, um, a rhinoceros in there. Um, so we are uh, talking about zoo animals. And uh, I thought it would be fun to do some finger plays. So let's do the first one that's called I Know a Giraffe. It goes like this. I know a giraffe. His neck is real high. It stretches and stretches till it reaches the sky. He lives on the plains, that's the grass, with an elephant too. And you might see him if you go to the zoo. Love that song. All right, also we can do five little monkeys. Five little monkeys, okay. Five little monkeys swinging in the tree. One, two, three, four, five. T's and Mr. Alligator. Here's Mr. Alligator, you can't catch me. Then along comes the alligator so quietly. <laughs> oh, he got one of those monkeys. There's four. Four little monkeys swinging in the tree. T's and Mr. Alligator. You can't catch me. Then along comes the alligator so quietly. Oh, 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 we got another one. Three little monkeys swinging in the tree. T's and Mr. Alligator. You can't catch me. Then along comes the alligator so quietly. Oh, oh, oh he's fast, that alligator. Two little monkeys. Swinging in the tree, teasing Mr. Alligator, you can't catch me. Then along comes the alligator so quietly. Oh, he got that one. One little monkey swinging in the tree, teasing Mr. Alligator, you can't catch me. Then along comes the alligator so quietly. Oh, he got all those monkeys. That alligator is fast. He's quiet. Shh, and he's sneaky. No more monkeys swinging in the tree. They can't tease Mr. Alligator. You can't catch me. But along comes the alligator so quietly. <laughs> that alligator burped up those monkeys. He's so funny. All right. That was some really fun finger plays. And uh, if you get the next video, I'm going to read a story called Never Ever Shout in the Zoo.